Hi everyone, welcome, welcome, come on in, come on in. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well and I hope you've had a good day. Thank you so much for coming to this video. Thank you guys, welcome. Okay, I love you guys so much. Right, so this reading is going to be for the air signs, okay? And it's going to be done by the extraterrestrials, the ETs, okay? It's messages from them, okay? They're giving them to each sign. They've asked me to communicate this. It is not a reading done by spirit, and spirit is not really involved in it, okay, um, directly, okay? It could be involved through the ETs, um, but they are not like the information is coming from the extraterrestrials. Obviously, the extraterrestrials are, well, um, very, very nice and sweet and kind and humble, and they do have a lot of light energy. They're very lovely, the ones that I communicate with. And they do have um, psychic abilities that are extremely powerful, okay? And very, 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 very intense, okay? A lot more than what we would perceive as psychic powers. And also they have um, such um, healing energy, okay? The energy is healing, okay? They're very well versed with communication, psychic communication, healing, healing at a distance and everything and all that. And they do it. They do help me as well with my work, which I'm very grateful for. I feel very grateful for their presence and I'm humbled by it. So I'm going to start this uh, reading, you guys, with a prayer. Okay, so if you could all um, please just relax, chill um, and pray with me. Pray with us. Spirit of the Most High God, we call upon you. Spirit of the bearers of the white light, we call upon you. Spirit of the mothers, we call upon you. Spirit of the fathers, we call upon you. And the siblings, we call upon you. Children of the corn, we call upon you. Holders of the holy horn, we call upon you. Pleiades cluster, attend. Arcturus, attend. Orion, attend. Canis Majoris and beyond attend, Ursa and the North Star attend. Council of the Stars attend, protectors, guiders, healers and watchers attend. From those that give light under the name of the Most High Lord attend, we seek refuge in the Most High God from any and all devils, demons and negative energies and vibrations Lord protect us, Lord grant us success. Lord protect us, Lord grant us success. Lord protect us, Lord grant us success. Amen. So I'm going to start with Aquarius. So Aquarius, wow. The energy is extremely powerful. I'm feeling so much love from you guys. Thank you so much. I love you guys. I love Aquarius so much. You guys, your your powers are increasing at this time, okay? And this is an understatement. I should be literally shouting and screaming and jumping up and down and saying, Aquarius, <laughs> look at what's going on. Okay, so you really are having this upgrade, okay? And this is like something that's happening all over the world, okay? Anyone with Aquarius, not just their sun sign, even ascendant, uh, even a moon, anything like that okay the the powers are increasing the the light within us that we give out all of the aquariuses on the planet is very powerful at the moment okay and your flame is rising very high is what the ets are saying to me they are love they love the sign of aquarius and always when i've communicated with the ets they've always highlighted aquarius for me because they say that aquarius is uh, a sign that is holy to God or ho God made it holy basically or it's like close to God God loves the people who fall under the sign of Aquarius and it is mentioned in the holy books, books and so on they also love the humanitarian energy of the Aquarian people and the love that they have you know this unconditional love that they have for creation their open-mindedness okay the minds of Aquarian people all over the planet are important because you guys are going to help raise the vibration of the planet, okay? It's not really um, favorable times at the moment for the planet as a whole, okay, because of everything that's going on. And if you go and see my most recent prediction that I did, I get these visions every now and then, the ETs 
give me or spirit will give me visions okay the holy spirit of god will give me visions and i will see that um what is going to happen on a global scale okay and then i will say it very close to when that thing will happen and there's specifics in the readings <clears throat> so the most recent prediction was about what you see on the news now and i did say it was last week and they said within a week something is going to appear and it did I was surprised today to open the news and find out. I always get surprised by my predictions. I still get surprised, okay? Even though I've been accurate since a very young age, okay? I've never had a prediction not happen, okay? Which I'm grateful for. It's not my doing. It's something I've been given, okay? Not something I've created or I've, I've, I've claimed in any way, okay? So I am grateful for it. It's not been wrong so this time has come through so check out that prediction because there's important information in it about what is going to come okay and how to deal with it and how to do you know how to be safe there's there's spiritual advice and how to be spiritually safe from it the physical stuff of course we all do our best and may god protect you all and protect us all and from all and any harm okay everyone who attends these readings will be protected to an extent because the readings have a healing energy within them okay and that's something that the extraterrestrials are saying for sure like you know um they're saying do your part but we are sending you a lot of healing and protecting energy so i'm feeling so much love from you guys thank you so much so aquarius they're saying that you're gonna get what you want they're showing me violet flowers and i think the scent of violet is gonna be very lucky for you as well to work with at this time or to wear it violet in spirituality we use it to to get what we want okay so if there's something that you want okay and it's fairly yours fairly okay uh you violet will bring it to you okay we don't operate in any black magic or anything that will force anyone to do anything. But Violet, when we use it in prayer, it helps the energies work together to bring us what we want. And this is what they're showing me for you, Aquarius. You are getting what you want, okay? I'm feeling you guys are feeling very serene and I'm getting just this very relaxed feeling, an open feeling, okay? If you haven't been feeling like this, you will be feeling soon. Okay, many of you Aquarius are have do have actual connections with extraterrestrials. Okay, some of you are not aware of it because there's so many around us. If you take a night vision camera and look at the sky, they're everywhere. Okay, and they have they have a reason to be there and they have every right to be there. Okay, because the universe operates as one unit and, and the higher energies, they work together to get the best outcome so that nothing falls out of balance and no one is hurt and so on and everyone gets amazing things so you are getting what you want especially when it comes to love it is show me this big 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 violet flower and with a big heart around it and this this is an expression of how much the ATs love you but also it is an expression of you getting love and what you want in love they're saying it's the end of all the messy relationships and the relationships where you didn't know where you stand. The relationships where you had the best of intentions but you were judged. The relationships where there were empty promises, okay? You do have a very powerful connection um, and a connection that is divine with the extraterrestrials. So they're saying work with the violet, get some violet flowers or fire violet essential oil or violet fragrance um and they're saying uh, pray put it on and pray you'll get what you want okay if you, especially if you keep doing it for say for a week every day okay that that's that's like fail proof that <laughs> and then you stop then you'll see okay sometimes for many of your queries because you're so powerful it will come before that okay for best results they're saying you can mix it with jasmine okay jasmine is a pulling like and it's like a magnet okay in spirituality it brings what people want yeah so they are saying that this um love that you're getting is what you want it's not what anyone else wants it's want it's not it's not what anyone else I I desires it's what you want many of you especially if you are of the lgbt community because i'm feeling an lgbt energy here there's a rainbow okay uh, you guys are also getting love and it's very powerful because i feel that someone is watching here and they haven't had much luck in love Okay, they're saying that this is your time to get what you want.
Okay, you're very protected. You're pre protected and the energy, they're saying that there was a negative energy. But as much negative energy that you've had around you, stopping you from getting love, is being transmuted by the extraterrestrials to positive energy, especially if you're listening and you're someone from the LGBT community. It doesn't matter what your sex is or your orientation, okay? They also want you to know that you are loved by the universe, you are loved by the creator, you are loved by the high, high powers, okay? And I think one of the most important tests for people in this life is going to be re with regards to LGBT people. Are they going to judge them and torture them and hate them and hurt them or are they going to accept them? And this is, what's, this is what, exactly what makes the difference between someone who will go to heaven and, and someone who will be in a questionable situation after they pass on. It's this. Do they accept Okay, LGBT people because they're different and try and help them and support them and protect them or do they go the other way? As it is in any other kind of test, whether it be a test connected to person, people's race, people's financial status, people's looks, people's um, capacity to do anything. Okay, if the judgment is based on ignorance then that is what is dangerous. And this is what the ETs want to communicate. I think you need to know that you are loved if you are from the LGBT community and cherished and held in very high regard. Thank you so much. I'm feeling a lot of love from you guys. Now, those of you who are not from the LGBT community, you are also loved and cherished and held in high regard, okay, by the ETs, by everyone, okay? And all of the people who are under the sign of Aquarius are getting love. I really do feel the energy of many of you guys. You haven't had the best of luck in love for a long time. I'm seeing 10 years for someone. I'm seeing 17 years for someone. It's been such a long time. Okay, all this time, it's been inside you. But this time, around this full moon... This is when it's going to be cracked open and someone is coming, okay? A, a masculine energy is coming towards a feminine energy. And this is so powerful, it's literally girdled and held fast by the Creator through the, the extraterrestrials, through spirit, through any other thing that God would want, wants to use, okay, to bring this together. It's important that your vibration is high, Aquarius, because you, the, the vibration of the planet heavily relies on how Aquarius people vibrate. You're getting breakthroughs in abundance like you've never seen before. And a lot of abundance is connected to this union. And I've seen in my work throughout the years that abundance with unions that are meant to be, when people are meant to be together, the floodgates of abundance open. And I feel that you're going to start experiencing this abundance just before this person like makes their intentions official to you or like real you like maybe you've talked to someone or you've seen someone or they've seen you or talked to you or something like that could be have a some kind of connection or even for some people a friendship that's going to change into a love once this tra transition is close where the commitment is close and the expression of love is close and that connection then the floodgates of abundance are going to open. Once that happens, know that love is coming to you. As soon as you see whatever constitutes financial abundance to you happen, okay? Now, I am feeling that you guys are amazing. They want you to know that you are powerful. They're asking me to tell you to work with the Woodruff herb. Woodruff is... Or buy some or carry some in your pockets or whatever, put it at home in a in a glass jar or, or whatever, okay? In a in a in a in a in a muslin sack, whatever you have, yeah. Um that herb is bringing you victory on all fronts. You Aquarius tend to attract a lot of jealous energy, a lot of negative energy, a lot of people who are low vibrational energies that are low vibrational, they want to stop you, but they are never winning against you again. This is the end of the victory of the evil um, energies in the whole world and in the universe at large. There's a big shift happening. And that shift, shift your light smack in the middle of it, Aquarius. And nothing negative will ever hurt you. Okay, so they want you to proceed with confidence. Everything's going to be amazing. Your prayers are going to be answered. And you're going to get even more than what you've prayed for. They want you to know that. 
So they are thanking you for your energy. Thank you so much, you guys, for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Check out my extraterrestrial messages and revelation series in the play uh, in the playlist section, and also please check out the um, most recent reading, which has info important information. And like I said, it's ma it's manifested. So um, I'm I'm quite like you know. Today I've been in prayer all day, like thinking, wow, you know, these things are like really, there's a plan out, there's a plan, okay, and at least that is reassuring, and, and of course we pray for the victory and, and abundance and happiness and joy for everyone, okay, and everything. Thank you guys so much. So now I'm going to move on to the sign of Gemini. Gemini's. You guys are very, very unique, and you guys are standing out of the crowd. There's some kind of love connection where you, Gemini, stand out um, from the competition. Like, this, I feel that there's a feminine, that there's many people who are competing over her. But the one with the Gemini sun or rising or Venus or whatever that is in the chart that is pertinent to the relationship, is the one who is winning. I also feel that this feminine, oh my God, someone has been through a lot of pain because um, I think this is just the waiting, the pain of waiting. I'm feeling it in my chest, goodness me. Let me hit my chest. It's so, um, it's so deep, you know. Someone really loves uh, um this feminine here, love that is like very, very powerful. I'm feeling the energy of a water sign. A water sign as well. Okay, so there is water here, Scorpio. Maybe someone has Scorpio and Gemini, I don't know, but I'm feeling a, a Scorpio energy. And um, whatever the energy is, please know that this relationship is meant to be Wow, I'm, I'm feeling so much love from you guys. Thank you so much. I'm feeling it here. I'm seeing it. So the ETs want you to know that whatever competition that you're going in, you're going to stand out, okay? You're also, your gifts and psychic powers are opening up, okay? They're asking me to ask you to work with green things, like green plants and like get some house plants or plant a seed outside or grow some kind of plant okay they show me um like the va the vanilla tree of all trees vanilla and i don't know maybe one of you has a vanilla vine at home or something so if you have that let me know in the comments they're saying working with these things is going to really bring a lot of positive energy to you your love connections and to your health and everything i'm also seeing someone receiving a message here about love it's about love this is a soulmate connection as well so this message is going to really make both of these people happy because i do feel that this feminine energy here is in anticipation of this energy coming in it's going to be fantastic you guys there's also a lot of um abundance connected to this uh, union okay when the union is right there's always abundance from my experience i mean it happens straight away okay even before they come together physically sometimes it starts okay there's also an energy of you being able to discern between good and evil or clarity with regards to a situation like you know that this situation now you see clearly what's going on with it they're saying as well that the um the uh, this uh, union when these two come people come together they're going to build something together it's gonna be such a powerful love but it's so authentic and original it's very very incredibly incredibly um uh, passionate this relationship okay there's a lot of passion there okay i'm also feeling an energy of another air sign could be aquarius you might want to go and watch the aquarius reading the aquarius yeah and I feel that someone here is stuck on someone, like they can't get over them. Like the, this masculine is stuck over the feminine, they just can't get over her. Okay, so if that's, if you're the feminine Gemini, just know that this masculine really has good intentions and is coming towards you. If you're the masculine, then this is a sign for you to go ahead and do what you've got to do. Okay, <laughs> like, you know, as a man, you know, go for it, you know. I feel that this feminine is going to receive you with a lot of grace and 
and be like really loving towards you and open and she's great you know this woman is amazing whoever she is amazing okay she's someone who's magical as well there's something magical about this feminine it's like i'm seeing this um wand person holding a wand they i want funnily i can't see if it's a man or a woman <laughs> but they just showed me someone holding a wand and it's a feminine energy, okay? It could be LGBT if any of you resonate with that, you know? So it's such powerful love. It's also very pure. It's very pure. So you guys are amazing. They want you to know you're going to be doing great. You are expanding both financially and romantically. You're going to have, from what I'm seeing here, probably the most amazing Christmas you've had, okay? This is a very, very powerful connection. The number nine is significant here as well for someone, number nine, okay? I love you guys so much. Okay, now let's move on to the sign of Libra. Hi, Libra. Thank you so much. First thing I'm seeing about you, Libra, is that your bag is becoming really big. When it comes to your finances, there's a lot of money, okay, coming to you from somewhere. Yeah, it's a lot, or maybe you keep your you have a bag of cash or coins at home. I don't know what I'm seeing, but I'm seeing this bag that's full of like money. Okay, and I'm seeing it coming in in a very sweet way. You're receiving communication about something that is going to make you so happy with regards to your finances. Something's coming full circle for you. It is also, there's a very powerful angelic energy here or angelic connection of some kind. So... You could have a connection with the angels, Libra. I feel really someone here who is like an angel themselves, but does have connections with actual angels. And when you pray, these angels, they hear your prayers and they take them up straight up as a matter of priority. Such power with your prayers. Please remember me in your prayers and remember us in your prayers and my channel and everything. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now I am seeing here as well that someone here is stuck on someone as well. They can't move on. Um, it, it's... Uh, <sighs> It's so beautiful. There's a healing energy here, okay? Um, I'm getting breathless because it's so beautiful. It's a healing energy. Someone is healing someone on an extremely deep level. And it's such powerful healing, okay? Now, this person is a psychic as well. Or maybe both people in this connection are psychic. You know, you have this... I'm seeing this energy of a psychic or someone who can see the future... Please know that you're very powerful and you're very beautiful as well. You're very attractive and you know your worth, which is a very good trait. And they're saying that, you know, you are, whether you're a man or a woman, you're extremely um, good at communicating and with words and people love what you say. You're always very positive. I'm also seeing here that you're very secure Okay, I think financially you're a bit protective over your finances, but they're saying that don't be um, uh, uh, worried about people being interested in you for your finances because the one that is meant for you, there's going to be a lot of signs and synchronicities and things that will, they'll just let you know that this is the person for you, okay? I'm seeing the letter... What is this letter? Bear with me one second. Yeah, M for mother in someone's name. So they show me the ETs, they show me M. M for mother could be anywhere in the first or second names, okay? And it could be even in a parent's name, okay? Letter M for mother. There's also here an energy of physical attraction, very powerful physical attraction between two people, okay? There's very strong energy of a passionate um almost i'd say lustful energy it's like someone was lusting over someone and looking at them and lusting over them um but the intentions are good behind this lusting energy it's like someone who's just loves the way that the other person looks and smells and feels and when this happens that's how that's how they're gonna be um there's also an energy here of friendship um, it could be a friendship that's going to change into a love connection or 
you could start as a friendship and then change yeah and change into love or it could be like there's also this um for some of you there'll be this energy of friendship and love at the same time okay now i'm seeing a lot of obstacles being removed from your path libra something wasn't clear there was a lot of confusion with regards to this situation but then clarity came and clarity came as as well connected to this full moon energy because the full moon helps people see hidden things okay so it's it's like they they make uh, uh the truth known or people will know the truth about a certain situation there's an lgbt energy here as well if it resonates with you it's a very powerful LGBT energy. They're also saying that you are protected and the other person is protected from any negativity or any negative person or any negative energy that's trying to mess with this union in any way, shape or form. Okay? It's a very protected union. I feel as well it could be that when these people come together, especially if it's an LGBT relationship, there's going to be like... Um, secrecy about it or like not telling people which is a good idea always okay i'm tell people once something happens to you that's good don't go around telling people straight away wait it's like when you stick something together with glue you don't go and leave it and go and tell people about it before it sticks you know the glue sets you know <laughs> your art piece has to be together before people see it right so this has to be um it, it it has to be talking about this connection that's going to be kept under wraps whether it's lgbt or not doesn't matter it's just the connection is going to be kept under wraps okay now you are someone who's very psychic like i said your gifts are starting to open up especially they're telling me when it comes to hearing spirits maybe in the past you used to see them or you used to see the energies um, and so on and see stuff but now you're gonna start hearing a little bit um, and it's gonna come to you with a lot of light and powerful enlightenment okay you are gonna help so many people as ascend as well okay there's some kind of there's an energy of a hidden treasure here okay there's something very valuable that is hidden okay or someone sees the value the hidden value of someone else or the potential of someone else and that's what makes them really attracted to them okay because there's like the, this both forces are going to be both both people are going to be joining forces and this connection has a lot of financial blessings coming to it there's a lot of finances coming to you guys big like i said in the beginning big money but also this connection is also connected to a blessing in finances. And I see that always when connections are real and meant to each other. Okay. Now, there is also here, the road is open for you. I'm seeing someone coming to someone as a client. And that's being very clear. Someone is coming to someone as a client and then it takes off from there. Okay. It's beautiful. And someone is so generous here. Whoever's coming to the other person as a client knows about them. There's going to be a message. It's going to be a bit long, okay? <laughs> it's going to be like explaining. I feel this masculine is going to send it to the feminine and be like explaining himself or trying to explain himself. But the feminine is so beautiful and so chill and so laid back. She's going to receive him so gracefully and he's going to feel like he's been treated like a king, you know. It's really amazing energy here. Now, Libra, they're saying that you are also going to be someone who is going to be attracting a lot of people or this this feminine energy anyway she's attracting a lot of suitors okay but you do stand out and there's gonna be a strong um energy of joy and happiness around christmas time i feel there's also an online element to this connection okay and i feel like um this Powerful angelic collection. Let me know. Let me, it's an angelic connection, not collection. <laughs> an angelic connection that is very powerful here. Let me know in the comments, you guys, if anyone works with the angels or you have seen angels or you have like a connection with the angels. Okay, someone is being crowned with success as well with regards to a project or work or a job or getting this kind of deal or business deal. Um, it's going to be amazing, okay? You're going to be really showing off your talents, Libra. You are someone who's actually very talented. Hats off to you. Um, 
And you're not someone who feels jealous about anyone or anything like that. That's very low vibrational. You're someone very balanced and you know there's room for everyone and everything in this world um, and that there's not going to be any problem. The ETs here are very proud of you. They're giving me all of these messages. Obviously, they're very proud of you. Um, and they are proud of the person who's LGBT here as well. They said you're amazing. They said you're going to be your prayers are going to be answered in full and they said do not worry about anything they are saying to work with time i think i've said this before in your readings i don't know if someone has wor been working with time let me know in the comments you guys if you've listened to me but if you haven't this time herb is very very powerful and brings out your beauty we have the recipe of the um, queen marie antoinette's beauty bath recipe from our family who've inherited it and um there is time is one of the main ingredients okay especially the red kind so the same buy time and you can actually you can bathe, bathe with the herb you can use the essential oil you can do all kinds of things with it and it will help highlight your beauty make empower your money uh, make you not lose any money and always gain and be happy and be joyful within yourself. Time is powerful, okay? You'll see once you start using that essential oil, watch it, how everything is going to change, especially if you combine it with prayer, okay? Prayer to God is the best thing because it, may, it brings you a perfect result because God is perfect. So, you guys, a lot of abundance here for you guys. Well done to you all. I love you guys so much. The ETs love you all. They said focus on natural things. They want you to work with um, plants, green things. They said buy some plants or put them outside. They also are saying look after your health. I love you guys so much. I'm feeling powerful love here. And this love that I'm feeling is standing out. Okay, from you guys. Your love is standing out. Okay, I love you guys so much. I will see you guys in your next reading. Be blessed always. Thank you.